BoilerBot is a name that our students came up with. It is a robotic greenhouse. That will disperse seeds, water. It will also be able to weed. Well, it uses an optical lens. When it plants, it plants on a grid for X and Y for planting different crops because it's programmed to plant certain seeds in these areas. So it knows that it's supposed to have lettuce or rhubarb in an area and it shouldn't have this other plant that's slightly off center or has a different leaf shape from what it's looking at. In Anderson, we are working with Tech 120 and we're working with the engineering technology department to help make the electronics work, the robotics piece work, and the computer programming work. So this is a collaborative effort across all of our disciplines here at the Anderson campus. I, I think this is an awesome project. It's an opportunity to help somebody with the prototype that the students are building, they're hoping to demonstrate a, a proof of concept so that their ideas will actually work. If they do work out and they work the way the students think they will, then um, the future beyond that is to expand on this. Uh, they're building a single planting bed for this, but then they can expand it out into multiple beds, multiple greenhouses, a larger area, um, potentially the business side of being able to create something that may be marketable and may be able to help people outside of um, the Anderson area, it, it's really just trying to help the local community and trying to help make sure that, that they have food. The plants are going to replace the APA's backpack program and put fresh produce into their backpack program so that they have fresh produce throughout the weekend. It's great that this bot is going to be able to like provide fresh produce in contrast to having some kind of like it's already been like shipped and packaged and you know sent across the world like it's great that we'll have fresh produce that's you know on campus and we'll be able to have it really whenever I think that this project is very good for the students that aren't necessarily provided everything that they need. I think that this um, project will help not only with the food, but also help build us as a better community. They're going to be able to cook a meal and sit down together, so I feel like this project is going to build relationships. It's going to help them to carry on through their life and be more successful in life because they'll realize someone did this for them and they're going to want to do something like this for others. I'm very excited. I cannot wait to see the robot, all the pieces come together and the robot work. I cannot wait to deliver that to the board and here's the Preparatory Academy, to the superintendent and to the principal. And more than anything, I can't wait to see how the students, the looks on their faces when this all comes together and when they actually see their hard work pay off. Anything can help another community. I mean, Purdue is doing a great thing right now where they're helping out this small school. I think that the students will be able to put the community into their mind. When you think outside of the box, you're going to help so many people. If you stay in your little box in your comfort zone, you're just staying there. You're not going to reach out to others. But when you reach out to others, you're really going to make a difference.